<laughs> okay. Just Chanel here. Okay, I'm gonna make a medicine ball because I have lots of lemons. I don't even need to use the pineapple. And this will be a benefit tomorrow too. So let me, um, I need to find some chamomile tea. Let me get myself together because I'm gonna keep choking if I keep coughing. Just enjoy the vibes. <laughs> All right, how to make a medicine ball at home. <laughs> I am sick, so excuse the kitchen. <coughs> Ooh, start with a stock pot, fill it with water. Okay, y'all, it's me. I'm actually back in good health. Let's do four cups of water in your stock pot. I feel so much better. This got me good in about 24 hours. Um, definitely great for allergies if you're under the weather. And you just need this in your pantry, like, because nobody wants to have to go to the store or order something or be worried about eating when you don't have an appetite and you're sick. So in your water, you want to add in the chamomile pyramid sachets, of course, the quality wellness tonic. This medicine ball kit that's sold on my site, sipquality.com, includes all of these ingredients, so you don't have to shop for anything. You just keep it in your pantry and everything's available for when you're feeling under the weather or if you have really bad like spring allergies, this is perfect. Um, also, I like to drink this iced just for optimal health. Um, add in some elderberry and peppermint, which is also included, and you want to steep this for about five minutes. Don't over steep it because you don't want it to be too strong. Uh, and remember, this is quality, so you are dealing with some quality ingredients, and you don't want your tea to end up being very bitter, bitter because these um, ingredients are potent, okay? Add in a lot of lemon. What I love about this recipe and making it at home, um, a lot of your, your favorite beverage place that y'all like to go get your coffee and stuff at makes this, but they use lemonade, which is very high in sugar. And so using real lemons is really going to boost your immune system. And I think it tastes a lot better. It's not as, you know, it doesn't have that like artificial flavor to it. So I add about three lemons in there, a lot of honey, which is going to help with your sore throat, your cough. It's also antibacterial. So it's just gonna help kill anything that's going on. So after letting that steep for about five minutes, give it a good mix. Make sure you remove the tea out of it. You can use that tea again in like a single cup of tea if you wanna make it for a family member or you know, just if you run out of this and you wanna make this again, you can actually use those ingredients again. And then scoop it into a big old jumbo mug like this and enjoy. Just so sweet. Um, if you watch my channel, you know I typically do not add any sweetener to my tea, but when I need a medicine ball, I definitely add a lot of honey. Um, thank y'all for watching today. I had to do a voiceover because I did not want to choke through the whole video. Um, hopefully, this helps you if you're a little under the weather. Um, I will leave all the ingredients down below, and of course, shop my tea shop at sipquality.com for everything that I used in this video. The pot is from Time and Table. I'll also link that down below. It's a really nice stock pot. I like using it for like one pot meals um, when I'm cooking rice for a large crowd, pastas, and also things like medicine balls. So uh, yeah, this is bomb. Mm. And I wanna mention also when drinking tea, especially making loose leaf tea, um, don't worry about your loose tea leaves. They will settle to the bottom. So you don't have to strain the tea or anything. Um, you can just drink it right out the pot. And um, if you use about a gallon of water, you'll make enough to last the whole day. I recommend just sipping tea throughout the entire day until you feel better. Generally, it takes about two days for me to like be back to my regular self. Uh, mm, it's so sweet and delicious. <laughs> Y'all stay well. And thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.